It's IBC 2023. We're on the Fabrics Leader Stand here at the show. And I'm talking to Martin. Hi, Martin. How are you Hi, doing? Simon. Very good. Thank you. So we spoke at NAB. Uh, this is your flagship uh, portable test measurement platform. Um, now award winning. Yes. For those that haven't seen it yet, give us a quick overview. Okay. So we've had lots of interest in 12 gig SDI, yeah. for example, and 20 and 2110 IP solutions. Um, but our rasterized version, where we're taking HDMI to a, to a monitor, lots of people, particularly in R&D, um, want a device that they can move from station to station to do their various testing. So that's what brought this product. So it has three uh, sort of power sources, mains, DC, or camera battery. So it yep. now becomes uh, portable. What we've done though is to make sure that uh, we, you know, ease of use is, is always foremost in, uh, in our minds at Fabrics. So for example, I've got a, a setup here, but every instrument is still active. Um, and if I want to zoom in on a particular tool, I can just okay, double well, tap yeah. and go in. But all of the tools that you would expect in the Fabrics products for testing 12 gig SDI, 25 gig IP. Cool. And what updates has it seen since its launch? So, um, interestingly, we've gone a little bit retro with it for IBC is we've added SD support, both okay. in SDI and in 2110. You might say, well, surely everybody's got enough SD equipment. <laughs> but we sell a lot to broadcast equipment manufacturers. Yeah. So, the, um, you know, the, to have all uh, flavors, formats in one box yeah, is that's paramount. That's the key thing, yeah, absolutely. So we've yeah. added, but we've also added uh, full range support. So, now we're giving the post-production guys a lot more sort of latitude in the in the colorimetry and um, and the ability to quickly switch between an SDI source, a 2022-6 and 2110 as well. Cool. So probably six months in the field now. What sort of feedback are you getting? Fantastic. Um, I think people know Fabrics from its sort of uh, handheld range. Yeah. So they've always said, oh, love these devices, but I want it in a, in a more portable form factor. Yeah. Hence the QXP. Yeah, and what type of users are using it? Um, mixture, again, uh, most of our customers are, are people who are present here. So mm. predominantly manufacturers mm. using it in R&D, but then also in their sort of production test environment. Right, okay. And then once the uh, manufacturers have developed their own product, then it goes more mainstream into broadcast. So particularly in the engineering department and mm. also in quality control. So monitoring everything going on within the facility. Yeah, just touch on this award here. Yes. What was that for? Proud what winners of the uh, <laughs> TBB Europe Best of Show Award, and that's specifically for the uh, QXP. Fantastic. So we're pleased, pleased about that. Congratulations. Thank you very uh, much. Where can people find out more if they're not at the show? Uh, if you're not at the show, um, check us out on www.fabrics.com. Martin, thank you very much indeed. So we're doing a couple of videos here on the Fabrics Leader booth here at the show. Uh, so do check those out on the channel. And for everything else we're doing, you can check that out at kitplus.com.